The Yalink device management platform aims to provide easy and flexible deployment and management. It includes YDMP and YMCS and is compatible with Yalink's SIP, Teams, SFB, MVC, VCS, and USB devices. The main differences between YDMP and YMCS are the deployment base, administrator, and cost. The highlights of the platform are as following. Remote troubleshooting, real-time alarms and diagnosis, remote resets and reboots, timing of tasks for flexibility, a graphical QOE, an API for deep integration. After logging into the Yadlink device management platform, preview, status, call quality, and unread alarms will show the operational status of all enterprise devices clearly. Device management features include the SIP device list, the USB device list, room system, firmware, and resource management. The SIP device list shows all enterprise devices, including SIP, VCS, and DECT. Devices can be added by entering the information of each device or via batch configuration. When the information has been added, the Yalink SIP devices will be automatically reported to the platform after they've been unpacked and charged. The administrator can check the IP address, firmware version, and status of devices. You can also click the operation button to get more information. Device management supports selecting a specific device to update its configuration file and firmware, as well as setting or canceling a user's DND, and performing a reboot or factory reset of a device remotely. Firmware management allows the uploading of a device firmware and resources. After firmware has been uploaded, the administrator can select devices to upgrade them with the specific updated firmware version remotely. It also supports setting the timing of updates for improved efficiency. Device configuration includes model, group, MAC configuration, and global parameter settings. Via model configuration, the administrator can create a unified template of configurations for the specified device and deploy devices via graphical parameter configuration and text editing. When you have configured the settings, push the configuration for the specified type of device to finish updating the configuration. When an enterprise has more than one branch or organization, site management can help the company to better classify its equipment or add, delete, and modify sites and more. Task management allows the administrator to time the completion of the device upgrades perform reboots and factory resets, etc. It supports setting a scheduled task to facilitate management during a specified time, as well as viewing the execution result of each task and the failed task history. When a device has an anomaly like registration failure, firmware upgrade failure, and configuration file update failure, the platform will automatically detect the malfunction and trigger an alarm. The administrator can check the alarm list to view the devices with warnings and details of the problems, and then quickly diagnose the devices. Device diagnostics support packet capture, network detection, exporting system logs, etc. The administrator can obtain device details and quickly pinpoint device issues through remote diagnostics. Dashboard supports recording and monitoring each call detail of a device and then provides a graphical statistical analysis of the call quality. System management enables the administrator to create multiple system users and supports the flexible allocation of different role permissions.